Hello, and what are you talking about? Turkey for Christmas? Remember last year, you were all talking about getting locked down and you got locked down. And what were you going to do for Christmas? And this year, you're talking about what you're going to do about turkey not being on the table. Well, at least you will spare some lives. Innocent birds are not here to entertain you for your Christmas. This idea that has been beaten down onto the the very very core of the human behavior and compulsions is what is causing anxiety, panic, compulsions, and even worse, a complete and utter distortion of life. Not just for oneself, but for everyone around. In everyone's mind, it's about the turkey. It's about the turkey farmers not being able to provide you. And it's about the supermarkets not being able to deliver your turkey. Why don't you slow down and reflect upon life and realize your nonsense that you've been be been tolerated for all these years, for centuries, for two millennia. And remember, a life of that innocent bird is as profoundly important as what you imagine of your life. So instead of thinking about what you have to do and what you have to do and what you have to do, and so many people are talking about cooking the turkey now and freezing it, deep freezing it. How much of energy are you willing to invest and waste just for a simple an insignificant aspect of life, an event? There should not be an event for you to celebrate life. For you living and you thriving and you still breathing and still alert to life, that should be a celebration. And if you pay attention to that mortality, that reality, you will not go chasing, looking for birds, turkeys, complain about you not being able to sit at the Christmas table with the turkey. You will get up and just do what is needed for Christmas. If you're that concerned about, if you're that worried about, if you're that significantly important about a turkey dinner for Christmas. Remember, this is not about a religious aspect or religious significance. This is about your puny significance, your petty significance that you've taken on about your life and you're surrounding others to get involved in the same nonsense. Why don't you at least realize a conscious, more involved way of living, sparing a bird this Christmas? Last Christmas, you stayed away from your relatives and family because of lockdown and the virus that was spreading around. And this Christmas, it's about time you spare a bird and stay away from the turkey. And if you really want to celebrate, celebrate life together with everyone. Where there's a hungry stomach, where there's a frail body, a frail man, a frail woman, a frail life, 
extend your life energies for that life to also blossom and to energize with a conscious nurturing rather than suppressing, compressing and depressing and more often open up your humanity and live a more profound and a joyful life.